Now this has to be creme de la creme when it comes to BMW X5M. What a car this is. I have sold many X5Ms, but this seriously has to be the best. From the factory, this car cost 132,000 pounds. I've got the invoice. Everything about it, power, performance, sound, the way it looks, the gadget and gizmos, it's just unbelievable. One word. 24,000 miles, 2021-21 registration, one owner from new, full BMW service history, and it's had its most important running in service. I'm gonna talk a lot about this car because there's so much on it. The first thing is the color. This is an individual paint from BMW called Nardo Grey. Very desirable, a very popular color, and it really does suit this car. It's got a 17,000 pounds extra on this car. It's a package called the Ultimate Package. What it really means is it's got everything, literally everything. It's full of it, all the gadget and gizmos. But if you haven't driven an X5M before, you will be shocked because yes, it has ground clearance. Yes, it's an SUV, but there's no wobble. It's tight, it's sturdy, it's solid. You put your foot down, it goes on corners, it reacts, it's sharp. It's like driving an M5, just a bit bigger, and that's what's really good about it. And it does make a tremendous sound when you're going through the gears, when you're just driving. From the front, the first thing you'll notice is all the black styling. You've got the huge M grills there, what you call the kidney grills with the double slats. 360 camera system, things you get on every car, I agree, but just going through what you do get on this particular one. All the inserts at the bottom are finished in gloss black. You've then got the M bumper, so unlike a normal M50D, 30D or something like that, the X5M, this is all different. It's a bit more aggressive, a bit more out there. And then you get the extra skirting splitters right in the corner sections there. This one then has the BMW laser headlights. And you can see that straight away just from the blue accents in between the LEDs there. And you have the daytime running lights, which is the sort of half moon LEDs, which is perfect. 24,000 miles, the condition, Obviously, before I start the video, I had a very good look around it because sometimes a lot of these high-performance cars, they've got hundreds and hundreds of stone chips where they're just everywhere. This one, I've had a very good look around it. Don't get me wrong, it's done 24,000 miles. Will there be a handful of stone chips somewhere? Absolutely, and you'd want there to be because that's just normal characteristic of a used car that's been driven. But because this car's been driven very, very well, not too hard, you can see clearly on the bonnet there might be one or two stone chips, but this is a very, very good example. Tremendous exa example. Moving on, you've got the competition wheels, which is the, I mean, the beautiful black chrome with the black insert, red brake calipers, but again, in perfect condition as well, 21 inch in size. You've got the color coded fenders, front and rear, and they stick out slightly more, so it gives that aggressive look. You've then got the carbon fiber mirror cap covers with the LED strip lighting, and they're the M mirrors, so you can see the, the wings there. You've also got the X5M side air vents there, the black window surrounds, black roof rails, some protection glass, and then you've got soft closed doors, which is not standard. It's all part of the, the ultimate pack. Soft closed doors, when it clicks, it shuts by itself, and that is nice and easy. Comfort access, and then you have that lovely, I mean, it's brilliant to be fair, it's absolutely beautiful. Silverstone interior with the ebony, quilted leather. You've got ambient lighting everywhere. The illuminated X5M on the headrest. Now this one has the full driver assist plus package as well, so it drives itself. But let's focus on the speakers on the door cards for a second, because this costs a lot of money. Bowers and Wilkins surround sound system. Illuminating just behind, obviously beautiful finish there. Extra speakers with illumination. You've then got the middle one here, and then there's more speakers in the back. Full sky lounge, which is an illuminated sliding panoramic roof. The ambient lighting across the middle dash, the center tunnel, all leather, leather, leather down here. You've got heated cup holders, and then you've got the cooled cup holders as well. So one for the coffee, one for the cork. Wireless charging pad, USB, two keys. You've then got the sports exhaust button, the iDrive system, which you can control the media from, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, obviously navigation, David Digital Radio, push button start. You've got heated seat, ventilated seat, electric memory, and then you have massaging seats. You, you really, I can't emphasize how much this car delivers on. Value for money, if you're watching this video and you're looking at an SVR, you're looking at other X5Ms, SQ7, RSQ7s, whatever it might be, you're talking about a 4.4 V8, beautiful, bulletproof engine producing 625 brake horsepower and not a 16 3.8 seconds in a car this big is mind-blowing, literally. 
but then you have to go with the colour, the spec. It's just like, you know, sometimes when you're buying a used car, you might tick five, six boxes out of the 10 of your desired boxes that you're trying to tick. This one, if I was looking for a car like this, it's every single box, all 10 ticked. Perfect. Or go and order a new one and pay £132,000 and wait two years. This has rear seat entertainment. It really does take the biscuit, this car, a little bit because it has everything built in rear blinds. Just for the kids, hello. And then you've got, obviously, around here, heated seats. This is touchscreen, navigation, different applications, as in the apps are available on there as well. Centre armrest comes down, the extra speaker system, the lighting, obviously this lights up as well, remember, but it's the condition, 24,000 miles, look at the rear seats, rear climate control, the whole roof lining, including the B-pillars, is all Alcantara, so it feels nice to touch, it looks good. But if you look up there, because you've got the bowers and wheels, you'll see the extra speakers just above the B-pillar, the silver fascia there. And then behind me, for the rear passengers as well, just up here, what a finish. But then stop at condition again. Side of the car, dents, scratches, etc. If you look down the road, none, zero. And that's not because I've touched it, we've fixed it, we haven't. This is how it's come to us. We've literally washed it down, ready for the video presentation because we want to get it out there as soon as possible. Because the first genuine, serious person looking for an X5M doesn't want to be missing out because I haven't had one with this spec on. I won't probably ever get another one. Not when it's one owner because a lot of these X5Ms are like a lot of the high performance cars. And this is not a bad thing, it's just, that's just what things are at the minute. People buy these high performance cars, they wear the t-shirt and then six weeks later, 12 weeks later, they change it. So a lot of the times an X5M will have four, five, six owners on. It's not end of the world, but it's just if you can get one with one owner, full BMW service history, with the right spec and the right colour, it's, it's a good find. That's what I'm getting at. Rear spoiler with the double lip. Obviously the camera system, LED rear lighting system, the huge rear diffuser, look at the vertical slats, and then you have the quad tailpipes, because of sports exhaust, and it's a competition, they're finished in black. But then if, with all that power, with all that space, you want practicality, and this is where this wins again. It's, you can quite easily go and buy an M5, an RS6. But look at the boot space. It's four wheel drive, ground clearance, power, full of toys, and then this going away for weekends, business meetings, golf, kids, plams, just suitcases because you're going away. So many times I have lots of nice customers who buy nice cars for me, Porsches, 911s, Turbo S's, and the rest of them. But you buy one of them, and then you have to have another car like this just to get about, do your daily thing. This ticks every single box. All the buttons are there. Underneath here, you've got, could be a whole space, lock and wheel, nut, etc. Seats still go down 40, 40, 20. Just wow, literally just wow. Everything about it, the colour. The rear bumper on the X5M is slightly different because of the reflector, so with a wider stance, you can see that's different to an X5 30D or 50D. Rear volante is completely different. The 3D, three-dimensional LED lighting system. Just one more time from this side. I mean, what more can you ask for? The leather is so soft, it's rich. Beautiful. And then as for the driver's side, Electric memory seats. You can adjust the driver's seat by pressing that button there. And then you have the full multi-functional steering wheel. So a lot of the features that I've mentioned was just about the car, what it's got, what it hasn't got. The driving assistant package. See this here? Can you see it? Do, 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 do. They flash. So this car steers on its own. Obviously you have adaptive cruise control, but it, it does steer on its own. You have to hold it or touch it every few seconds, but it goes round corners on its own. It brakes on its own, it recognises the speed, it just, it's such a far-fetched, modern, up-to-date version of, a, of any car out there. You've got the M1 and M2 shortcut buttons, Bluetooth, stereo controls, heated steering wheel, everything. Heads-up display, full digital dash with the M badging on there. Like I said, all the services have been done in this car. Most important, the running in service. You can touch the screen to use it. You can use the iDrive to move it around, do what you want, but it's got everything. So remember, you're getting the best sound system. You're getting the best color, the best specification. 132,000 pounds. I wasn't lying. That's what this exact car cost. I've got the invoice brand new. Now, 24,000 miles later, in a superb condition, very well looked after, under manufacturer's warranty, still till 2024, for a lot less money. And you're not gonna have to wait or hang about. I have to say, it is the best. Part of the ultimate package, not that it makes a difference in the performance, but aesthetically it looks beautiful. 
you also get the carbon fiber BMW M Power car, um, engine bay cover, which is nice. Lovely. I absolutely adore this car. I think it's perfect for somebody that wants to be practical but wants the power. It's a bit of a petrol head. It's a perfect color combination. Seriously, do your homework, see what's available. You won't find another one with this sort of spec on with one ownership on full service history. My name's Joe, my name and number's on the screen. Give me a call, drop me a text or a WhatsApp. If you've got a car currently you want a part exchange, I'll take it in. If you want to look at PCP figures, HP figures, just give me a shout, I'll be more than happy to help you. Thanks for watching, bye bye now.